I, I think that I have learned uh, then when you distill many of the things that are out there that are troublesome to people and uh, negatively affect their lives, negatively affect their health, uh, that uh, there is one that consistently comes up and, and that is being more mindful, being more present. We spend our days and our with our minds turning and rushing around thinking of our to-do list and the future and the past and worrying when uh, most of that, you know, and we miss what's going on in our life because we, we're doing that. Uh, it creates stress. Uh, stress is causing huge amounts of, uh, of, of health care costs. Uh, up to 70, 80% of all visits are stress related in some way. We're not built for that stress. Our hunter gatherer ancestors were not built for that kind of chronic stress and it uh, it destroys relationships it destroys uh, it creates wars it uh, it, uh, it, uh, it it diminishes the quality of life and uh, if we can just find a way that every day at least for a short time even if it's just seconds at first where we're truly in the present uh, just as an example I ask an artist uh, you know what happens when you draw what happens to time? I have no sense of time. And right. when you don't, you can't be stressed. And I say, how do you feel? And I get anything from comp happy to joyful. And so something, you know, when it is there, you know, if it's with a pet or it's with a book or it's in nature or it's meditating, find just, I would have everybody working up to, even if it's just minutes a day, because that makes all the difference. A world that's more mindful, I think would be kinder to everyone.